all powerful tools have a downside. It's a two-edged sword. This is a really uh, great technology for uh, making medicine more accurate, in fact, also uh, reducing the time it takes to get to the best diagnosis and treatment. But with that, there's a liability. In fact, there's many liabilities. And so things that could happen to an algorithm that has been beautifully validated could actually go south when it is implemented at scale. And so the difference here now is that when you have a doctor that makes an error, it's a one-to-one -one story. But when you have an algorithm that's being widely used and now has a glitch, a safety glitch, it could hurt a lot of people very quickly. So you can never let your guard down on AI algorithms in healthcare. We have a lot of problems with AI that we have to reckon with. Uh, one that is talked about quite a bit is black box, that is lack of transparency. And that's kind of interesting because there's so many things in medicine today that we don't understand, but we are using in daily practice. So are we going to hold algorithms to a higher standard? Most people would say yes, because this is something that will be used at scale. So we like to see the AI fully explainable, it's so-called XAI, to make algorithms uh, explainable. And that's a movement right now which is getting legs because you can use the same deep learning tools to deconstruct the algorithms to understand the features that explain how they work. So that's an important one. Another one that's really issue of safety is adversarial attacks. We are worried that whenever you have any software, that there could be malicious, nefarious ways to use that to hurt people. The whole cybersecurity story is centered around that concern. So that is certainly one that exists with AI.